Hi, in this video I'll be showing you how to find the derivative of y equals cot x. Now in order to find this derivative we're first going to have to say that y is equal to 1 over tan x. We then multiply both sides of this equation by tan x. If we do this we're going to get tan x multiplied by y equals 1, right? Now to get dy over dx we're going to use an implicit differentiation formula. That is the function of x multiplied by the derivative of the function of y multiplied by dy over dx plus the derivative of the function of x multiplied by the function of y. If we use this formula, we're going to get tan x multiplied by dy over dx plus sec x squared multiplied by y is equal to 0. Now let's transform this equation. So from here we're going to get tan x multiplied by dy over dx equals minus y multiplied by sec x squared. Now from here we're going to get tan x multiplied by dy over dx is equal to minus cot x multiplied by sec x squared. Now, how did cot x appear over here? Well, y is equal to cot x. Now from here, let's multiply both sides of this equation by 1 over tan x. If we do this, we're going to get dy over dx is equal to minus cot x multiplied by sec x squared multiplied by cot x as 1 over tan x is cot x, right? So we've got minus cot x squared multiplied by sec x squared here as dy over dx, but this can be simplified further. Cot x squared is actually minus cos x squared over sine x squared. And sec x squared is actually 1 over cos x squared. So, as we've got this equation here, or this expression here, we can get rid of the cos x squared at the top of this fraction and the cos x squared at the bottom of this fraction. So we're left with minus 1 over sine x squared as dy over dx. But this is in fact minus cosec x squared. So if y is equal to cot x, dy over dx is equal to minus cosec x squared.